Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. No one minute man. Oh wait, that's not it. Hello, 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 y'all. Welcome to another cookie crumble review number 479. With a new box and it's real cute. It's real cute. It's like a little road map. It says bringing friends together. <laughs> Bringing friends and, and family, family together. together. <laughs> Use your words. Yeah, no. We practice it's it. It's a pattern. Sound it out. <laughs> Y'all. Never mind. They're just freaking. Uh, hello. Welcome to breakfast week. Would you like to see these cookies and just get right into the game? Am. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Hello. Phonetically spell it. Um, look at these. Y'all. Go ahead and tell them. breakfast week. What have we got to do? I don't know. I don't know. Tell them what you did. Oh, I've eaten an entire bagel cookie, and we'll talk about that when we get to it. Auburn Street, and I ate it. She ate one bite. I ate the rest of it. I'm going to say my swat shirt. <laughs> I probably hate all this. Um, <laughs> honestly, I think they look delicious. What say y'all? It's breakfast week, so they're all breakfast themed, minus that pink one. And now we only have, we are back to having four new flavors a week because the pink shade is back. Pink shade is back and, rotation. Chocolate, and chocolate chip. But you know, we never get the chocolate chip. because we, we need to get that one We week. will, we will, because we haven't reviewed it in no. a really long time. <clears throat> so let's just get right down to it, honey. All right. Uh, which one doesn't have an icing? Let's do Fruity Pebbles. Well, talk about them all. Oh, she forgets the order of this. I do. <laughs> hey, French toast. This one's hard to pick up, y'all. Let me tell you, this is a soft, soft, <clears throat> soft cookie. Is it more cakey, like a bread? It literally is like bread consistency. I love that. A buttery, fluffy cookie topped with cinnamon egg wash, yum, buttercream, a sweet syrup drizzle, and a sprinkle of powdered sugar, yum. It looks That's delicious. That's going to be great. That's served warm. It smells literally like French toast. Mmm, I'm excited for that one. Milk glaze featuring fruity pebbles. <laughs> I was so excited I could have done backflips for this one when they had it before. My only complaint was that the cereal was stale and the cookie didn't have much flavor, but we'll see if it redeems. A soft cereal milk flavored sugar cookie brushed with a milky glaze and topped with bright fruity pebble cereal. I've never been more impressed with the idea. The idea, and I love the look. It's cute as can be. And I love fruity pebbles. I love fruity pebbles. Um, iced oatmeal. We've had this one before. Sweet and spice. The cinnamon oatmeal cookie is smothered with a yummy vanilla cream cheese glaze. A complaint that we had before was it needed more glaze, but this one looks like it's got a good amount on it there. Does. And then, yeah. well, the pink sugar, y'all know the pink sugar. It's just their signature sugar with almond. almond. If you don't like almond wedding cake flavored stuff, you're not going to like that. But some people lose their minds over it. And then, y'all, this one, me, this is the one that's breaking the crumble internet. Almost everything they go served warm. A fresh take on a savory treat. A mellow cookie. I don't know what that means. M-E-L-L-O-W. Mellow. So it's not, they're saying it's not going to taste like a cookie. A mellow cookie rolled in a special seed mix and topped with a swirl of softened cream cheese. <laughs> y'all, me and him go into a knockdown drag out argument. I know that shocks y'all. Oh, about that cream cheese when we were reading it. I said, Tyler, it's gonna be regular cream cheese. And when I tell you he all but told me to go lay down in the middle of Stone Drive traffic because he was convinced it was cream cheese icing. And I was like, it's just cream cheese. Today he texts me and says, that was just plain cream cheese on top of that bagel cookie today. I knew, I knew she'd bring it up. I was gonna say it, just hope she wouldn't bring it up. I told you. So, I thought there was no way in Hades they would do that. I figured it would be a slightly sweetened cream cheese. I wish, you, I wish I was wrong. I know. It's a squirt of liquid cream cheese. Squirt. Look at I, it. Okay, let me tell you why I have trouble with this. Got my hair, I'm sorry. If you gave me an everything bagel with cream cheese on it, I would be thrilled. I love bagels. I love cream cheese. My brain is struggling that this is supposed to be a cookie and it has cream cheese and seeds on it. If it was in a bagel form, I'd be thrilled. But honestly, I'm a little nauseated thinking about that. I thought I would be too. I tried it. Look, I ate the entire cookie. Auburn had a portion. Is portion it sweet of it. at all? A microscopic amount. But See, not really. Um, 
Not really at all. Stressed about it. Not really at all. That throws me off. Do you want to just do that one first or you want to no, do it last? No, last, yes. All right. What would you like to do first? Fruity Pebble. Princess. I've got I'm a plate sure. down here that I'm going to cut with. We have had this one before, but it's been so long that I'm willing to maybe say that we were wrong. Because mm -hmm. our palettes have changed. <laughs> do you want eights or fourths? Uh, eights is fine. It cuts beautifully. Honey, it's a fall plate from the Sam's Club. And we've got our little ranking paddles down here. Mm -hmm. This is like a big cookie. I know they all are, but it just seems bigger. I like those fruity pebbles inside. Mm -hmm. The fruity pebbles on top are the stalest thing I've ever tasted. Mm -hmm. The flavor is good though. They could they, they couldn't make them more still if they tried. <laughs> the flavor's great. <laughs> it's just the staleness. Which I I mean I guess you can't help a cereal. Well, if you ate it fresh, I don't think it would be stale. He got these earlier today. So if you're getting fresh. But only if we've only had them for like hours. I know. The taste is good. It is. Was that one served warm? Mm-hmm. I like it. I feel like I feel like this is my default score when I don't know what to do. <laughs> Six. Do I like it? Yes. Would I run out and get another one? Maybe if it was fresh. I would. And I appreciate the idea, and that's not something you can buy at the Kroger Bakery. I'm going to put these back in here, and there was somebody that commented oh, oh. that got all tore up that I was putting leftovers in here and licking my lips. So let me tell you something, honey. You're never invited to have these. You're, you're never going to be invited to have these. So you won't have to worry about it. You can go get as many crumble cookies as you want in your lab at home and wear your hazmat suit and <laughs> eat them in the privacy of your own home, <laughs> bubble girl, because you don't have to worry about it here. I mean, that's like a cord. Thank you for the view. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, I'll have you know at the jail, Christy, Marie, Antoinette Frazier, if I defecated on all these cookies and told you to eat them, you would. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. She literally and would. And would be happy. Today she said. And I, if you defecated on something and told me to eat it, I would. Today we were getting lunch orders and Julie said, do you want a uh, shoku, Christy? And she said, no, I have Chinese from last week. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> she was going to eat Chinese food that she got last week for lunch today. That has been in the jail freezer. It, the fridge. Never. I don't even want to eat anything that's one day old, honey, let alone a week. She will. Christy. It's already mom growing on, honey. She's eating it. We, this is a Christy Bash session. <laughs> Love her. <laughs> Y'all, this is my New York sweatshirt. Every time I see it. What about my swatch shirt? Cry. That's the race I did this week. Yeah. That's the race I watched. Everybody's like, such a beautiful couple. Talking about me and her. <laughs> <laughs> the crickets in the background. <laughs> Literal crickets. Honey, some people. Hey. They just don't know. Brandon clarified. All right. My uh, mom did? Yeah, she was like, oh. my beautiful daughter and her best. Honey, if there's anything mom's going to do, it's clarify. She Oatmeal? Could, yeah, while you're cutting that. My mother. Y'all. Eights or fours? Eights. Eights. I make her nervous, I think, because I'm really outspoken, and you're going to know how I feel about everything. You're just sorry about it. You never have to wonder. But I make her nervous. Well, I shared something funny, and it was the Bath & Body Works stress relief, energy, and sleep lotions, and it was someone pumping all three of them in. Like, hoping for the best. And I said, me, uh, thinking about going back to the jail after a three-day weekend. Everybody knows I work at the jail. But my mother... Went in the comments to clarify that that's where I worked. I guess in case somebody thought I... Was going to jail was after a three-day bender of freedom. Serving weekends or something. So, honey, mom made sure everybody knows. I was just, that's because I work there. She works at the jail. I was like, mom. Brenda. <laughs> honey, this is the iced oatmeal. We've had it before, but we'll see if it changes. It smells like a honey bun. Mmm. 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 Ice good. cold milk. Mm hmm. Um, it tastes like a really good, chewy oatmeal cookie with a good glaze. Mm hmm. 
Really good flavor. Mm. Huh. Not over spicy? No. But. A little plain. A little plain. But good? Mm-hmm. Six and a half, seven and a half. We put all the point fives in that one. I feel like that was worthy of a point five. It's a good cookie. It's a fine Once cookie. Once again, from Crumble, I look for things like originality, French toast. This was too much. Um, but give it to them for creativity. A ten on creativity. At a cookie store. Yes. I want to make you taste this, or do you not want to? Um, no, I don't want to. But you go ahead and cut it and have some if you'd like. I love the pink sugar. I'm just glad it's back. I had forgotten how much I missed it, honestly. I don't even remember if we tried it initially, did we? No, because we had had it... Before we started the reviews. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Sorry, y'all. It's just real good. Kayla's calling. Who? Kayla. Honey, mm. we've got the boys' birthdays coming up. Excuse me, y'all. Here we go. If you like almond and if you like sugar cookies, it's the perfect Oh, one. yeah. If you like almond, absolutely. I just don't like almond. Next week for me. Never mind. We'll see what happens next week. <laughs> we don't know. We're just in these groups that... Thank they know. And some of them are right, some of them are wrong. I'm terrified that Maddie and Abby are going to spank me. I know. They're going to cancel us. They would never. They would never. Okay, you want to do French toast? Yeah. I'm excited. This is what I'm most excited about. I'm excited about it too. It's so unique. Uh huh. I will tell you, I'm not a big French toast person. Like, I would never order it. Never. I would eat it if somebody handed it to me, like at Christmas time. Mm -hmm. When my dad makes it, I'll eat it. But. I would always choose pancakes over always. waffles, pancakes, or French toast, would you? Pancakes over waffles? Yeah. I would choose waffle first, pancake second, French toast third. Waffle first? Mm hmm If it's crispy. I want pancakes with butter. That's basically just frosting. Oh, fine. I want it. Wow, it's very bready. And it's real thin in the middle. Yeah. Weirdly thin. Mmm. Mmm. It's strange. I can't pick it up. Mmm. The consistency is definitely nothing they've done before. Uh-uh. It's very much... Mm. Like a piece of bread. It's not overly sweet at all. Yum. I love the icing. I love the whole thing. I mm. love that there's not just straight up maple syrup poured on, poured on it. Mm. Mm. It's light and fluffy. Mm -hmm. Not dense at all. Y'all, that one buttery is good. Not and a half for Eight. me. It was good. Yum. I like it a lot. I really like the consistency of it. Mm -hmm. Didn't scare me. Mm. Sorry, y'all. Aren't getting leftovers of that one tomorrow. Oh, they're you're eating. They're here. not. <sighs> Just prepare yourself mentally. She's gonna throw a fit. You may love it. I may. My brain. I won't eat this, but I don't need to cut it. My brain. The Lord prepare. I was not prepared to like this one, y'all, at all. Auburn wasn't either. She was like, gross. And then she ate it. She was like, I love it. I'm on Fear Factor again. I know. 
It's definitely the most unique slash strange cookie we've ever reviewed. And honestly, cookie is a stretch. Oh. It tastes exactly like it smells. Okay. E. <clears throat> e. It's weird. Uh huh. Try it without cream cheese. I don't hate it. No. But I don't think I like it. It's almost like I've given you something in Chinatown and you're like, meh. Yeah. Mm mm. I like it better with the cream cheese. But y'all, it's salty cream cheese. Like, there's no sugar in that cream cheese at all. Mm mm. Mm mm. You know what I'm saying about having a slight taste of sweet, but not much at all? Yeah. Love it. You love it. I do love it. It would be hard for me to go buy that one because if I'm getting a cookie, I want it to be a cookie. Yeah. And that if I want a bagel with cream cheese, I just need a bagel with cream cheese. That ain't a cookie. It's, a, it's creative. Creative. And I'm getting them an A for effort. Did you see what I did? Yeah. Sorry. Honey, you do you. I'm just trying to be creative. Seven. One. That. It's really something. It's like, it, my brain can't, it's my brain, It's like if they came out with like a lasagna pizza. Or yeah, lasagna and you're like, cookie. it tastes like lasagna. Right. They, they, but kind of sweet, just a little bit. Yeah. I think, you know what? I think maybe if the cream cheese was a little sweet, it, it might it. be better. I agree. It's it's a very stark cream cheese. Just cream cheese, which I love cream cheese. If but had, the, the cookie has a hint of sweet. If the cream cheese had a hint of powdered a, sugar. Just a little bit. A scotch. And the outside salty. Yeah, and the seeds, y'all know how I am about that. I love the seeds. It's got... Um, that was wild. It's got poppy seeds and black and white sesame seeds. So, honey, if I have to take a drug test tomorrow, of course, the YMCA said, like, you are gone. <laughs> don't collect go, don't collect $200, never enter these doors again. So, that won't matter if I fail the drug test there. But... There's a lot of poppy seeds on that thing. What if Nate Davis drug tested you? <laughs> he would never. <laughs> <sighs> Man. Oh, and y'all. He might. I wiped my nose just now. So for the person who's mad. Oh, Lord. That when I was very sick and still trucked through the video was mad because I had to lean over and blow my nose. Who was mad? Oh, the person. Yeah. Please. What was this from? I'm disappointed this week. I'm gonna be honest with you, Crumble. I love you, but you really knocked it out of the ballpark two weeks ago, and we've never been the same since. I don't think this was a fail. Not a fail. I'm just not super enthused. Like, there's nothing that I'm like, ah. I feel that way about the French toast. The French toast is really good. And I don't hate the Fruity Pebbles. I'm not mad, Crumble. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. You're I'm disappointed. Talking? I'm not mad, I'm disappointed. But everybody has different tastes. They do. Man. There's a rumor that it's going to be Minions Week next week, and they're going to have this one that's stuffed with an almond stuffing. But in a good way. It's going to be a moon cake. I don't like almond. What's a moon cake? It's like a Japanese cookie. I like almond. For the past three days, she I'm has projectile vomited exclusively in her mouth. <laughs> She's like, you're about ready to go. <laughs> <clears throat> I had surgery. That never flared up until yesterday. It never went away. It did too. 
No I've never noticed it. Honey, I live with it. And they damaged like my esophagus when they were putting the tube down my throat to put me to sleep. And so it like does something. If I drink carbonation, it like- Repeats on you? I'm not burping. Oh, I know. It's just like air. It's like what your body does. Yeah. Well, the jail wants to try, are they gonna try? Yeah, of course, honey lord, if I didn't go in there with them. And also we've got a bunch of taste testers now, but the rules changed. But the what rules changed? The rules didn't change. They did. I've got some pretty pebbles stuck in my dentures. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have dentures. It'd be fine if I did. You think I was laughing at the pictures? <laughs> Anything oh. else I want to try? I, I want to love that fruity pebble one so much. Yeah. I'm glad not everything had a big sickeningly amount of icing this week. Mm -hmm. I usually like icing. I'm sad that you don't like the pink one. That's okay. I like their other sugar cookie ten times better. I love the idea of it. I just wish it was crispy crunchy. Y'all, I'm still stuck on that bagel. If y'all go get it, you're going to have to let us know in the comments what you think because I'm having a hard time with it. I will be interested. Go this week. I enter a support group. <laughs> go this week, try the bagel, and let us know what you think because it is going to be so divisive. It's going to be completely insane. People are going to be dying on a hill for it, and people are going to be demanding a refund. Three things you'd die on a hill for. Me? Nanny Ramy. Hey. Okay. My beloved cat. Um, well then. The cat. Like die on a hill for in terms of food. Just in general, anything. Nanny Ramy, New York City. And my heated blanket. Uh, you? Police officers? Football? Mm. And Dot Coke. <laughs> I love football. Actually, I love police officers more than you can imagine. Um, football can't relate. And Diet Coke, absolutely. I'd like to add that to mine as my fourth. Diet Coke? <laughs> or Coke Zero, or any kind of carbonation. Actually, no, you is the freestyle machine, period. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so I can get a strawberry fan. I keep looking at them like they're gonna change. Well. Y'all, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you get uploaded, uploaded, updated. Notified every time I upload a video. <laughs> What's wrong with me today? I'll be in New York in 20 days. I'll be at the Sloan County Jail in 20 days. Completely by myself. If y'all want to come with me, let me know. Spoiler alert. No, no spoiler now you're going to have, no, spo honey. Spoiler alert. No one's invited. He doesn't mean that. I do mean And for all I mean, I, No, I mean... Let me just tell y'all something. Crushing on my charges. <laughs> yeah, because I need to let everybody know something. Well, gotta go. If Tyler Ramey has ever in his life told you. Oh, great. He, I always get in trouble after you say stuff like this. If he's ever told you that he would love to go to New York City with you or would love to take you on a tour, I promise you he's called me and said, oh, never. Every time. Every time. If you think it doesn't apply to you, it does. Tell me I'm wrong. You're trying to absolutely... Yeah. Spread I'm just trying to put everybody's expectations down to reality. He's not going to take you to New York. I would. If, yes, it depends on the person in the place. Depends on the person. Well, you've got to find one that you'd agree with. I took Sherry. Your mother. Mm -hmm. Would you ever do it again? <laughs> Never. Love her. She gave birth to me. Love her. We shared a womb for nine months. I'm just trying to do y'all a favor because you have... We really only shared a room for eight months. You're trying to change the subject. There's 150 people out here on the streets of Kingsport who think Tyler Ramey is going to take him to New York. And, and I'm just telling you it's not going to happen. And we're all, they're just like waiting with their packed bag like... Yeah, because he's so... He's like, oh, I've heard him do it a hundred times. Oh, my... Yes, honey, tell me he went, never. I promise you, if he has said that to you, he's not telling the truth. And the thing is, I like to go by myself. Mm -hmm. I've been with her twice. 
Crazy. Honey, not everybody's gonna live in a dog kennel with you and look at you in your underwear. Well, that's true. If you're going with I them. I missed that one kennel. I know what to do. <laughs> the one where I threw up. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even know it. She threw up in the room, had no idea. In the bathroom? Let me preface, we don't drink alcohol. It was just. In uh, the bathroom. Uh -huh. you and just, I just slept right through it. And he was sleeping in the Right from beside the bathroom. The bathroom. Hmm? That was, I never throw up. I just woke up and I was like, was that the chicken tender night? It was when we ordered... DoorDash. Yeah, and we had Junior's Cheesecake. Yeah, but we also got chicken tenders, didn't we? I think, I think so, so, and I ran through it. So, honey. Just, you're welcome. Everybody, just, you're welcome. <laughs>